και κύριοι, τα αθλητικά κανάλια Cable News Sports φέρνουν κοντά σα το τέταρτο επεισόδιο τη Kick Off. Βρισκόμαστε σήμερα στο Αντώνη Παπαδόπουλο γιατί σε πάρα πολύ λίγο θα υποδεχτούμε τον ποδοσφαιριστή τη ανόρθωση, Σέρχιο Τεχέρα. Hello, Sergio. How are you? Very bien, thank you. So, a long time no see. Nice to see you again. Uh, so, how do you feel about your your team until now, the performances, the results, in your experience? Very good, very good. Uh, I think uh, nobody expected uh, us to be or to start this this league uh, at this level. Uh, it's true that maybe we we have a couple of games that we are not playing the the way we were playing before, but. It's normal, no? the the other teams, uh, they know how how we play and, and they they know how to stop us a little bit, no. But I think uh, we'll be back to to our best football and and I hope we we can finally fight for for winning something this league. So, which is the weak point of Anorthosis and which is your advantage against the other opponents in the league until now? I think. Uh, Uh, because nobody uh, thought about us, uh, and we we were very uh, I don't know, like an outsider. I mean, uh, we didn't uh, think that we are we are the best. But inside, uh, we know that if we work hard, uh, this team uh, we create. I think uh, the coach and the the staff did a very good job from the preseason. I think we create a very very nice family, all the team uh, and. I think it's the most important uh, we have uh, in all the teams I I had uh, I I was before. Uh, for me, this is the the key to to try to 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 concede something. And the witness, uh, maybe the we had the unlucky the unlucky to to lose uh, a lot of players this this year. Uh, And uh, we miss him. We miss them. Uh, we hope they uh, they can uh, come back uh, soon. And and um, that I think uh, it penalty a lot uh, the team. But uh, we we were able to 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 get good results. Also, your coach and your team come out, yes. managed to you know get not get a lot of influence by the injuries and the the guys who were unable to help the team. This is a big advantage for you and your team. You have been unlucky. That's true. Yeah, that for for one side is the one weakness that we had, uh, and also one strength. No, mm -hmm. uh, the the rest of the players who had to play when they have to go, to come in, they've been having less minutes. They did very good job, and uh, we have to to come back to to that line. So, what about uh, Coach Gallego? His strategy, the way he's uh, cooperating with you. How do you feel about uh, your coach and your team? I'm very comfortable with him. Uh, we speak the same language, so it's, it's easy for us to to understand each other. Uh, I I think I understand uh, from from the first day the the way he wanted me to to play on the on the pitch, and um, uh, he's he he's uh, like a, he's a crazy with the with the tactic and and, and with the football, and uh, I think uh, he's doing a, a very very good job. Do you have an extra role, let's say, because you speak the same language with him and he doesn't speak English? So, do you help in the translation or maybe to your teammates uh, to understand uh, better what uh, he wants from them? Well, during the week, uh, we have Oscar, uh, the assistant coach, that mm -hmm. that make uh, this work. But uh, it's true that maybe on the pitch, the coach tell me what was he seeing uh, in the moment, and I translate uh, to the to the rest. Uh, you have a lot of in common, I think, with your coach. Uh, in the past, you have scored against his team in 2020, I think. <laughs> If you remember that game? Uh, yes, yes. I think he, he was the coach of uh, sport in the Gijón. Yes. Yeah. Uh, and also, I, I was playing with uh, the maximum rival from mm -hmm. sport. You know, I was playing in Oviedo, and it's the same uh, uh, city and... Uh, well, uh, it's a very nice game to play, and yes, I remember, I remember that game. Uh, so we, another thing you have in common is the first time for him walking out of Spain and for your, uh, you know, uh, career, professional career, this is your first time also. 
you have been out for Chelsea, I think, when you were a teenager. That's right. And now it's the first time as an adult player going out of, out of Spain. So how do you feel about this? How easy or difficult is this for you? Well, for me, uh, because I can uh, speak English a little bit, not very well, but I can... Uh, you can communicate. Yeah, I can communicate with the, with the people, so it's fine. Uh, it wasn't too, it wasn't very, very difficult. No, when I came, uh, Chisco was here. That I know him. Antonio was here, Pietro, and uh, they helped me a lot. Also, a couple of Spanish players come uh, mm -hmm. after me, and and the city uh, uh, is is perfect to to live. We are very happy. My wife, I was worried for for my family. You know, my wife maybe she doesn't speak the, a lot of English, and uh, and my kids, but uh, they are very happy so, uh, here. So I'm happy. That's good. It's very important for the players to to kind of, to to be able to live with their family in their new uh, city, and it's very good for us if you feel confident with your family here. Uh, so, what about your partner in the middle line? For example, do you do you like playing with Tune because he's more defensive player, so you can be more freestyle player in the in the game? Well, this year uh, we play. Uh, I think we we all from the middle uh, we play each other mm -hmm. we play with yeah. with everyone. Uh, uh, I think uh, the we are um, a position. Also, we're waiting for for Arti to to come back. I I hope uh, soon he will be there to to help us. Uh, it's a position that anyone who who play, I think uh, they're doing a very good job, and I'm very happy with anyone. And what about the the injury of uh, Guerrero? Do you feel that there is more pressure now for you and your teammates in the team uh, every time that? Uh, a major player cannot help the team and another major player like you have to, you know, make some more effort during the games? Well, it's something that what we say before. Uh, we were very unlucky with, with these things, with the injuries. Uh, Guerrero, for us, uh, we all know, is very important. He's a very good player. Uh, he's a top player mm -hmm. for, for us. And um, it costs... Uh, mm -hmm. A lot of uh, pain to the to the team that he don't play because his role on the on the team where he's playing is very important, and we don't have something similar. No, so we have to change the way we play. Now we are playing more with two strikers, so it's completely yeah, different. Castel. Yeah. Which which way do you prefer with Casamay and Castel or you do and Guerrero? Nah, or you don't? I don't, ever mind. Mind. I don't mind. I don't mind. I don't it's, mind. It's, it's different, but you have to to assimilate the, yeah. uh, and uh, and and knowing that. We have to play different because they are different players. So I think uh, the team uh, did a good job uh, in this aspect. But uh, I hope he he will be back. So, but anyway, every player that uh, your coach wanted to help the team, it was uh, it was very nice. And Castellin, Casama, and everybody. It's really important, I guess, for your team. Uh, all the players can uh, make an effort and bring results. Uh, it's always winning. I think you have to firstly get over the problems. You are facing, and then you want to get the results. Yeah, what you sure. need to do with sure. the I guess. Yes, for sure, for sure. Uh, not only Guerrero with the injury of uh, Fran, uh, uh, and also the uh, Salva well, to yeah. to go to Spain uh, for this shit uh, cancer. So uh, it's a lot of things that uh, happen to us. Uh, uh, also Perea. He came here and in two days here, he lost his father. He had to come back we'll to, his country. to to stay with the with the family. So some things that affect the the team. And do you communicate with uh, with those teammates of you? Yes. No, but they are going uh, well. Or yes, yes, we keep in, in okay. touch. Uh, they they doing they doing well. Salva, uh, thank God, he's 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 good. Uh, he's making all the chemo and everything. Yeah. And he's taking. Uh, he's going through well. And I think Fran uh, will be back here soon to to start uh, working with us. So, great yeah. news! Yes, baby. Great news. Uh, so, what about the the league? It, it's a crazy championship. So competitive for all the teams, like the the first uh, six seven teams. Uh, what's your thoughts about the the championship? Uh, it's uh, it's special because I, I never was, uh, been in a league that uh, you had to play playoff after. Okay. Thing, so. Okay. It will be interesting, no? Mm -hmm. uh, if if we consider to to be in the in that playoff, that I think. Uh, of course, we will. Be. It will be. So uh, I'm uh, looking forward, very mm -hmm. looking forward to to play that that, that playoff. And if we, what well, I say before, if we come back to to be that team 
we were uh, at the beginning strong and 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 very hard to play against. Uh, we have chance. Uh, so, which team or teams has been the the most difficult, the most the, the hardest uh, opponent until now? Can you name a team that uh, was like a really tough game against them? A lot, uh, a lot of teams, a lot of teams. Uh, even the 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 teams that uh, they supposed to be the Every down uh, or relegate something, they they make very 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 hard games against. Um, uh, the people outside here don't know don't know the league, and they thought they this have a lower level than the level they have. I really surprised with the with the level with the level of the, of the league of the league, because the people from outside. I, I come from Spain. I I didn't know nothing about the this this league when I came. You didn't ask anyone. Did they know anyone I, in I, Cyprus? I tried to ask, but before I didn't know. And it's something that they have to to try to improve to to open the the league to the rest of the country. Mm-hmm. Because in Spain, nobody watch this league. Obviously, and, and maybe this is normal. <laughs> yeah, but uh, if they make some facilities because my family, they they want to watch the games, but they can't. So, ah, okay. but if you want to watch it, yeah. they can't. So maybe. They, they should try to to make something to to open the league to more people to to come come and, and watch. It will be nice for us if the Spanish people will watch our championship. Yes, <laughs> sure, for sure. So, can you name me one one team from the oh, uh, from the top teams? Yes. Uh, I think uh, for me the best the best players and uh, tough to play against is for me is Pafos. Pafos for me is the the more quality uh, squad. Okay. Um, and well, you mean Pafos uh, concerning the way they are defensive and you cannot uh, they are well more you may difficult to play your game or uh, uh, some specific his coach is very very I know him from from Spain uh, yeah oh you know him all right uh, I know I know the way he he, he treat uh, the teams and uh, I know he work a lot on on also on the tactic uh, defensive tactic and and it's very difficult to to make chances against them, mm-hmm. and also they have the talent with the players they have that they are, they are very dangerous. So they have both sides of of the game that I think that will make them uh, very strong. So what about the playoffs? Do you, in your opinion is there a key factor that uh, you need in order to get the results? It's like uh, uh, the psychology of the team. It's like the defensive line. Uh, which factor do you think is going to be crucial for the playoffs for every team? Well, uh, it's it's a short playoff, uh, and and if you everybody's playing each other, so I think yeah. uh, the, someone told me that uh, I've got no ammonia. They in the playoff they draw almost all games, and they they win the league or they get second draw in all the or nearly all the games uh, in the playoff. I don't. We know had if someone uh, told two me. years of playoff, but the one team was drawing or you couldn't win. So the second one won the the championship. They won a year, and the other year, uh, the, the the first two teams were losing the games. <laughs> so it was weird. So well, they they consistent. I think in in the playoff to to be able to don't lose like couple of mm-hmm. games in a row and and be like winning or drawing, winning, winning. That that will be the the key. Uh, so, uh, what about the players? Can you tell us some players that you think that they stand out uh, in the in the league? Maybe uh, your t- it's maybe it can be your teammates or players from another team or what? Do, what do you mean? That you you said about Buffos that they have a lot of talent. What about other players in other uh, in other clubs? That you you had you know a lot of fights in the. In the game, uh, I know you play like this in the derbies. <laughs> I have seen you, <laughs> and uh, so can you tell us about other players in other teams? Uh, I'm I'm very bad with the with the names. I, I now I I cannot uh, say exactly the the name because I'm I'm very bad. Uh, but uh, uh, yeah, in my position, I I used to to have uh, rough games to yeah, to, to the other midfielders and. Uh, and other midfielders the same. Maybe who, who more t- take me out of my, uh, how you say, piss me off uh-huh. and, and make me more tally. It was, uh, I guess, uh, Apuel. I think you, you got a card? Yes. Yeah. Yes. 
and uh, they they did good because they, they it was in my mind and I I I, I didn't have the, the the ability to to become but uh, it's no it's not will happen again. Vamos a hacer haciendo un día febrístico un break y pues So, how do you feel about uh, yourself, your performance until now in anorthosis? You have been here for a year. Uh, this year is very good for anorthosis. Uh, but, and, and the fans also feel that you are a major, a key player for your team. So, I think this is very good for you to feel this from the fans. Yes, I uh, I feel, um, feel very happy first uh, because all, also uh, the injuries respect me. So, I'm not having a... Uh, any any problems so that make me can can be in a, in a in a good level and also I I feel the 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 love of the the people when I go out in, on the city so it's something that uh, I appreciate and say thanks to to them and uh, also here that I think uh, all we all all season is being sold out mm-hmm. uh, so it's amazing amazing atmosphere in Andorra for the yes crazy. It's uh, one of the, the greatest teams in Cyprus, uh, most historical, uh, and always uh, they have a great atmosphere here. I think it's uh, it's very nice for every player mm. playing here. Yes. And then if you feel the, the this thing from this from the first day, or you feel it more this year? Uh, maybe I feel I feel it more more this year because uh, when I came, uh, the team was yeah, in a very that... bad uh, uh, situation in the in the table. Uh, and the people uh, when we played the the playoff for relegate, they didn't come to to the to the stadium, so I couldn't feel the uh, uh, this this atmosphere mm. that this year from from the first game it, it was something amazing. So do you, do you face any difficulties uh, concerning the the differences between living uh, in your country, coming here and working for your league, and coming in this league? Maybe in the first months in Cyprus, or it was very easy for you to. No, it was it was easy. I was uh, uh, prepared uh, a lot uh, mentally to 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 come here. Uh, that's what I want in that moment. I decided to to come because uh, I thought it was uh, good for me and and my family and to 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 live something something different uh, outside of Spain. And I'm very happy to to make that decision. It was easy. Did you speak with uh, any other player who was in Cyprus when you had you first had your proposal? Maybe a Spanish player who was uh, playing here. Yeah, hey, you. you uh, I was uh, when I was young. I played with uh, Emilio Sue, mm-hmm. and uh, I I spoke with him. I spoke with with Palanca. Also, he played in uh, Anorthosi, and they talk very good about uh, 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 Cyprus and and. Also, players from that that play and in Nike uh, spoke with me, and everybody was was saying that uh, Cyprus was very good. That I will enjoy to play this league, and it's true. So, so Emilia, we help you to to sign mm. with the, to take the big decision coming in Cyprus. Uh, he went. He had a great uh, performance now in a uh, in Africa Cup. Uh, what about him? Can you tell us some a few things? Uh, I was with him at uh, Mallorca when we were uh, very young, both, uh, and and he's, he's a very good friend uh, of me. Uh, he's a little bit crazy, but he's, he's a very good guy. And he, I, he, I, I, true. I, I love him, and uh, I'm very happy that uh, the work he did on the African Cup, and very happy for him. Uh, what about um, uh, which game do you feel that it was the best for you until now in Anorthosi? For your personal performance, mm, I, I I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe all of them. <laughs> no, no, no. Because uh, to be to be honest, uh, when I play, uh, I I try to be very focused, focused on 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 what I do, and then, and also I don't like to to listen uh, from outside uh, uh, thoughts. So I don't read pe- press. I nothing. Me, the Instagram. Sometimes I put some some picture, but I don't I don't care uh, too much in what 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 they say. Uh, obviously, I know when when I play well or when I play very bad, and and uh, 
I'm very... In, uh, I put a lot of pressure in, 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 in myself uh, to, to, to play well and to, to help the team. And, but to say one game, no, I don't know. What about your, your team's performance? Which game was the best for an Orthodox until now this year? Until now. Can we choose one? Mm, let me think. Let me think. Uh, well, maybe uh, Ophelos here for me was a special game because uh, we played with one man less. Uh, uh, I'll, more of the like 70 minutes. And uh, they scored a goal. We were one down, and we conceded to 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 win that game, and with one man less. And I think that uh, show a lot of from from this team. Um, can you tell us the the differences between uh, Cyprus football and Cyprus league and uh, Spanish football? A lot of differences, I guess, <laughs> or not at all? No, can tell us. Uh, more physical, more tough out maybe, of championship, maybe. Oh, the, I say this 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 league is very tough. Uh, it's true that uh, in Spain, uh, maybe here the the players they have quality. There are a lot of quality in the in this league. Maybe in Spain, they have more more players with quality yeah. and than than here, and that's the difference. And also, uh, uh, we are lucky to to have this stadium, and uh, maybe in. In Limassol with the Alpha yeah. Mega Stadium, but there every pitch is, there is uh, very good to play. The grass uh, there is perfect for for in every pitch you go here. Sometimes you have to go to some stadiums that they are not nice to play. They don't have too many uh, fans. Uh, the pitch is not in very good conditions. Yeah, the facilities this, are yeah, the much facilities. better. Maybe Spain. these things. Is the the big difference? These things influence a lot the the, the players. People th don't know, they don't understand how important it is for you. That but it's your work, and you need to have all the facilities you need in order to to feel good. So yes. it's, it's very important, I guess, mm. for everybody, wherever they come from, mm -hmm. Spain. Yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. I don't know which country, but we need to get improving that. We already know that. Uh, so considering your national team, you had a great season under seventeen in tw twenty. 2007, if you remember, you remember, you remember. So, can you tell us something about that season? Uh, yes, it was uh, very nice to play the the World Cup with. Uh, it was the final game. We had the yes. final game. Yeah, we played against Nigeria. Mm -hmm. The final penalty procedure. Yeah, we lose, yeah. we lose, but uh, very, very nice, very nice experience. I was uh, in youth team from from Chelsea in the in the reserve team. And they, they called me to go to, to play with Spain and I was, it's something very special. Great, no worry. The Gia was also the whole Yes. Was, yes, with a, Gia. the team. The Gia Nacho from Real Madrid. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, a couple of more players there that they played first division. Yeah, you also worked with uh, Pochettino in uh, Espanol. Mm -hmm. you, you have a great past <laughs> with uh, great personalities, uh, Sergio. Yeah, look, look, Pochettino, yes. Uh, I signed in Espanol after being in Mallorca. He signed me to come to, to Espanol and likely um, we didn't start very good that season and uh, he left uh, before the before Christmas. So I didn't have uh, a lot of time with him, but uh, good experience to have him as a coach. Um, you, so what about this experience for a player? When you have a lot of experience, you you, you get the influence for those people like Pochettino, like uh, everyone, and you just keep them in your mind. How do this uh, these memories influence you and these experiences? I think for sure it, it, it influence uh, at the end. Uh, maybe at the beginning you are young and you don't think uh, a lot about it and you just play, you just have fun. But uh, with the age. Uh, uh, it's true that uh, you look back and you you try to to take uh, the best things, no, from from everyone. When you first went to Chelsea, do you remember your feelings, your thoughts, your anything? I was scared. Things? I was scared. Yeah, I was very scared. I had a uh, 16 years old. I went there. Uh, sometimes they put me to train to with the first team with Roba Balak. Did you train or you just watching the other guys? And, uh, <laughs> Is it? I was like. I don't want to miss a pass. I don't want to say nothing. I don't... Oh my God. Very scared. 
But uh, I think uh, that helped me to 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 grow uh, as a person a lot. What else did, did, did help you to grow as a player? I mean, your tactic, uh, your way, your skills, and everything. It was your talent. It was a team you went and the way they they were they were working with you when you were young. Uh, I think I'm a completely different player than uh, when I was uh, when you start eighteen yeah, or twenty years old. Uh, and well, I say also with the with the age, you you have more knowledge of the of the game and you understand more more situations. Uh, uh, you work different. Uh, the day to day, and uh, I think uh, these things that you 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 are taking from you try to mm. or what I did, I try to take the the best from from everyone I have next to me. So do you do you watch any other leagues like I don't know? I in don't. England, I, in Spain? I don't. I don't really watch uh, football now. I you don't watch football? No, not at all. Okay. No, I like to relax. Yeah, when I go home, I I want to play with my kids, and that's it. So that this is how you spend your free time with yeah. your family and sure. yes, and the person. What about Larnaga? It's good. It's it's, uh-huh. it's small, uh, but you have everything. I don't need uh, too much sense. Have you visited other towns or maybe uh, do, 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 do any trips around Cyprus? Yeah, yeah. Well, Limassol, Ayanapa. I've uh, been to to Paf as well. Uh, Paralimni. I have been everywhere. Yes. <laughs> hey, do you have any good relationship with other players, even from an or other Spanish players from other teams in Cyprus? Yeah, in, well, in, in the in the club uh, with uh, with the Spanish players and Portuguese and um, Brazilians, uh, uh, is with the most we have uh, more. Um, we meet out out the the football also with uh, also with good ladies from from Mike uh, and very good friends. Is that what you mean? And, Okay. You know him from also from Spain. We play against a lot of times, and we we used to fight a lot. And uh, our wives, they are very mm-hmm. friends. So that's nice. What about like since you mentioned Gustavo Ledes? What about the, this team? Did they have been like uh, it's very impressive the 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 last thirteen huh. games? What about yeah. them? No, uh, it's uh, we. For me, I I knew that the the potential of the of this team mm-hmm. uh, when. When they start uh, the league, uh, they're losing games. Um, I, I knew that they will come back and win and and be at the at the top for sure for the for the team they have. Uh, maybe they 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 change coach and they change a little bit the mentality. They needed to clean the minds. They did. They find uh, the key coach for for them. Mm-hmm. It looks like so. Let's see how how far they they going. But they they doing very good. It's very difficult to. To be 30 games without losing, so... Yeah. Hey, what about uh, the previous coach of like, Ultra? Do you know Do you know him? No, I didn't. Have you ever met? No, I never met. I never met. I saw him when I, he was coaching in Spain, but uh, personal, no, no, I don't know. So, you know, you know, a lot of... Uh, we we had a lot of people from Spain and Cyprus. Now, when I'm talking with you, I realized that uh, a lot. we have a lot. Hey, what about uh, Joao Victor? You have been uh, playing with him. Next to him in uh, in Mallorca. Yes, he was one of the captains in Anorthosis after he finished from Mallorca. Yes, yes, they, are, they told me, they told me because I show him a picture in the in the kit uh, room. Okay. Of the team of that year, and I saw Joao and I say, well, he's born. I didn't know, and uh, they they speak very good about about him. Uh, he's a very good guy, uh, uh, very good, very good, very good, nice person, and. I was uh, with him at Mallorca, and I have a very good, I have very good uh, memories for him, with him. It's nice that you, you have to see familiar faces here, here in Cyprus, because it's not easy for someone to, you know, change country. And this is actually your first time going out of Spain, so I don't know if it, it was easy for you the, the decision that I'm I'm leaving my country, or it was cool, okay, for that with you. Or it, it depends on the family. What they want? I I had a, I was very short. Uh, I had a very clear uh, in my mind that uh, I wanted to have um, a moment playing in. I wanted to play in another league uh, before finish my my career, and uh, I had the opportunity to to come here. So uh, it was easy for me because it was a decision that I I wanted to make to to go out from Spain and play in a different league. So. 
It was a good well, choice, I guess. Yeah. I think. I don't know if you if you feel the same. I think it was a good choice. So what's uh, how do you see Anorthosi on May? What's the the future of Anorthosi this year? Your predictions. <laughs> I don't. I don't want to to. Uh, I keep it to to me what I think okay. we, we we will be, but uh, I'm sure we will fight for 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 something for sure. Uh, but uh, anyway, but uh, we have uh, talked a lot with other coaches and other players. Uh, a lot of them they are saying us that uh, they are they really like the way Anorthos is playing. Also, uh, Vladimir Milojevic, you remember him? He was in a, a coach of mm-hmm. Abuela Nabonon. We spoke with him last uh, in the last episode, and he told about Anorthos that he likes a lot of the way he Anorthos is playing. It's, 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 it's something. Yeah, it's something nice uh, that the people uh, uh, start uh, thinking this about about us. Also, they collect the other team, no? That mm-hmm. uh, to to play even better against us. Uh, but uh, they we are doing good job. But uh, now is the, the I think uh, arrives the the important moment, and is when when we better have to be, and for sure we will be. So you signed a new contract with Anorthos at till 2026. How do you feel? Very happy, very happy. Uh, when I came here, uh, my my idea was to to stay a uh, long time in 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 this country. If if I was happy, and I'm very happy, so uh, I believe a lot in the in the work of uh, Antonio, and uh, I trust him 100. percent And I I know that the um, the the future of the of the of the club is, uh, is gonna be very good and I'm very happy here so I didn't have uh, any dupes to to sign and um, what about uh, in order to sign you need to feel that your family feels great here you told us that it's uh, very good the things about your family here and what about your kids you, you told me off air that you have one uh, kid that was uh, born here in Cyprus yeah he born uh, 28th of of August in in Nicosia and. Uh, uh very very happy very happy the oldest uh now we go to the nursery here he starts saying uh, words in in english and in 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 greek and it's uh, mm-hmm. it's, it's amazing to to watch him uh, growing and and learning uh, different cultures and uh, i'm very happy for them well, that's very nice it's very it's very sweet to see your kid and growing up and learn a lot, a lot of languages uh, so If you have a contract until 2026, then uh, your kids will be like born and raised in Cyprus. Uh, that's good for us. Yes, yes, yes. That's, that's, that will be that will be very good, very good. Uh, so what about uh, Cyprus? Do you have uh, favorite food or something here? I, I like buy a lot. I like I like to go out. I like to to go out for for lunch and dinner and and try uh, new restaurants and it's very good, very good. So lucky, I love so lucky. You like, you like? So lucky. So, so lucky. So lucky. Love it. I love it. <laughs> in, in favorite, which is your favorite food? Paella? No. Nah. This is... Uh, That's the typical <laughs> No. Commercial food, I guess. I don't know. I, it's like, uh, I'm, uh, you know, uh, everything in the, like with fire and put the yeah. pizza. Okay. Barbecue, so everything that's what I most like. That's what you like. And uh, do you learn any, any Cypriot or Greek? And uh, words or phrases or anything? Well, some bad words. But I'm bad words, only bad, bad words. I'm not going to say it. You don't know, for example, but, the yeah, good to say, yeah, to say good morning, Kalimera, and uh, Isakala. Ah, you know. You know, that was so, the, uh, got it so... <laughs> the basic. Uh, yes, basic. yes. Oh, for, to ask a coffee and everything, yes. It's good today. Thanks for, for one year being here. It's uh, very good for you, knowing all these things. So, Sergio, I would like to thank you for your time. I'm wishing you, uh, from the bottom of my heart, all the best to you and your team, the best of luck. Thank you. And I'm sure that Anorthosi will uh, will complete the season with a great way. Thank you very much. Thank you.